Hey guys, welcome back to another video. In today's video, we're going to be making a cutting board out of two woods. So I'll show you the woods real quick and then we'll get into make, making the cutting board. Alright guys, so these are the two woods I have right here. This one right here is called... Uh, Sapple. I don't know what it's called really, but there you can see the name right there. And then this one right here is yellow and then that name's blocked out but there's something else over here rosewood maybe i don't know but anyways that's what this is so we're just going to put these two together like this and then we're going to glue them sand it down and everything and we're going to make a cutting board out of this so let's get into making the cutting board and then i'll show you the final results all right guys so first what we need to do is make a line to where we want to cut it. So let me get this right here. And then we're going to put it right where we want to cut it at. I think right there is a good spot. So now we're just going to line this up and make a mark. So that should be good right there. So now we're going to get the saw and cut that, and then uh, we'll glue it together. All right, guys, so now we're going to cut these two boards. So let me just cut them real quick. All right, guys, so... I got these, uh, we're gonna have to glue these together. So I got these right here, these little clamps. I'm just gonna get those to where I need to put them and then we're gonna glue them together and see what it's like. All right, so I'm just gonna put this under the wood. Now I'm just going to lean this down and then clamp it together. Alright guys, so this is done gluing. Oh. It's pretty should stay now i'm gonna sand this down because as you can see that has a little bit of an, an edge on it and maybe on this side too not on this side but on this side it has a little bit of an edge on it so i'm gonna sand this down with some 80 grit and get this flat and then we'll go get higher on the grit and so let's do that real quick Alright guys, so we got the 80 grit done right here, as you can see. It's uh, it's looking pretty smooth, but I'm going to go over it with 120 real quick. Alright, we got 120 done, we'll get a 220. Here's what it looks like after 220 right here. So it looks pretty good right now. So here's some 320 right here. All right guys, so now I got some 400. I'm just gonna use this with my hand because this thing is really smooth, but you know, I'll just, I'll just do this with my hand. So I'm gonna start sanding. Yeah, I got some 600 right here. So I'm gonna use this real quick. I think it's 600. Yeah, it is. All right, guys, so the last grid I have is an 800 right here, so I'm going to use this real quick. All right, guys, so I just got some of this wood wax. It says for cutting boards, and then it's safe, safe for food, basically. Like, you could cut food on it, and it, it, the brand is Walrus Hole. And then I'm going to put on just this 
little staining pad. If you don't have this, you can just use a paper towel or a rag, something like that to put it on. But I just have this already, so I'm just gonna use one of these. So I'm just gonna open it up. And I'm just gonna get a little bit of it on here. Like that, and then I'm just gonna spread it out. Alright guys, so thanks for watching this video. Make sure to hit the like button and subscribe and I'll see you in the next video.